Hey everybody, it's PJ from Donny FL and Karma Air Guns. And in this series of videos, we are going to be taking a 2024 spec Karma Red Panda, and we're going to convert it over to the 2025 spec. So this video is gonna be taking place in a couple of different segments. And rather than one giant long video, we're gonna break it down into component parts in the hopes that that more easily assists you with your work converting over the Red Panda. Now, if you have a 2024 spec Red Panda and want to make the conversion to the 2025 spec, you need to go over to the Contact Us page on the Karma Air Guns website, and that web address should be appearing somewhere down here. Uh, it'll also be linked in the description, but go to the contact us page, put in your name, your email, um, and let us know that you're interested in picking up the conversion kit. Um, and we will email those details directly to you so we can get you parts in hand so that you can do this conversion as well. So the most important and start point for this process is to remove the air from your Red Panda. So I'm gonna bring the shot down a little bit so that you can see what I'm working on and we will get this degassing of the Red Panda started. So there are a couple of different ways you can degas the Red Panda. I'm gonna use this right here, which takes a four millimeter Allen. And you're just gonna back that out till you can hear it hissing. And then there's another one on the buttstock. And if you turn both of those, not sure what the microphone's gonna do with that noise in the background. It may cancel it out a little bit but there is audibly, and you can feel the air coming out of those two spots. This does take a couple of minutes to finish. So my suggestion is you go get yourself a cup of tea or coffee or soda or whatever it is you have while you're working on your air guns. Let this fully drain. You wanna see not only the pressure gauges go down to zero, but you also want to make sure your regulator pressure on the other side is down to zero. And when that's done, you're ready to start removing the front end of the air gun and the back end. Now those are going to be covered in separate videos, like I said before. So until um, your air is gone, um, you can go over and queue up that next video because this one's over. 